What's up guys, it's the only Ninja Wing Aviators and a superhero hat bringing you another video here on the Modern Ninja channel and today is another awesome Saturday and it's not raining but I talk about weapons of opportunity all the time. I did a video about pins, I did a video about bottles or at least I plan to do a video about bottles. I don't know if it's actually released yet so uh, to be debated. <laughs> But today, I'm going to be doing a tutorial for you guys because, again, like I said, it's another great Saturday. But this time, I'm going to be covering how you can use an umbrella to protect yourself. Now, yeah, it may seem kind of self-explanatory. You use it and swack at people and swing at people. But you can actually use it very effectively if you know what you're doing. So instead of just kind of like swinging wildly at people to try to keep yourself safe. Uh, I'm gonna teach you a combination you can do to actually protect yourself in a more close quarters situation, not just flailing it around and hoping you hit something. So, run that intro so we can get started. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> uh, what we're gonna be doing is this combination. So first, I wanna show you how to hold it. Uh, most umbrellas are gonna be weighted at this end, where the handle is. The handle is solid. This end is not so much, and I see, I mean, I haven't seen someone actually have to defend themselves with an umbrella, but I've seen on movies and TV shows, when they do, they just kinda swing it around, and the problem with this is it's really hard to control, and if you hit somebody, it really doesn't have the stopping power that you need. And so in order to really get yourself protected with this, you have to use it more effectively. You have to use it more intently. So instead of trying to hold the handle and swing it, what I want you to do is we're gonna hold it just like this. Just like you were holding a staff ready to fight somebody, but you're gonna be using this stick instead. Using Having both your hands this way allows you to block more effectively and allows you to strike more effectively. So what we're going to be doing, we're going to start off like they're punching at us because I think it's better to defend yourself than attack other people. So again, defend yourself, don't attack other people. So what we're going to do to start with is we're going to use this side of the umbrella to block the incoming punch. They're throwing a punch at us, you want to block the incoming punch with your stick, knocking it off axis to not hit you. And again, whenever you're blocking something, it requires your reaction time, so make sure you're blocking quickly. So once you block, what you're gonna do is you're gonna step in with your right leg, using that right hand and your handle, you're going to crack them across the face as fast as possible, as powerful as possible. So it's gonna be block, one, just like that. Now, whenever you hit someone across the face, they tend to back up a little bit, and that's perfect, that's what you want to happen. So once you block, crack them across the face, you wanna step with that, so you can spin through and use the thin part to stab in to your target. So one more time, you're gonna be blocking one, stepping across the face, and stabbing at your, part, your target like that. Again, this is for when someone's attacking you. You should never go and attack people. I'm not teaching you how to like go and beat somebody up in the supermarket because I stole your milk. No, if someone's attacking you, this is what you do. So one more time, I'm gonna step back here so you can actually see the whole thing. They're going to block one, strike two, and strike three, just like that. All together, it'll look something like this. Ha ah. <laughs> ha! There we go, now I got it. Um, so, <laughs> that's what I, like, between cuts, that's what I do. I usually just, like, spin it around toss it and hope that I don't stab myself because I've never tricked with an umbrella before but like maybe I can <laughs> man I feel like Kingsman like this this is totally a Kingsman thing I I should do a fight scene based off Kingsman but regardless <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you want to see more like this definitely hit the subscribe button because that is super helpful I know I have a bunch of big stuff coming in the first month of next year in January. I have a bunch of stuff that I've been working on. Uh, I'm really super excited about it. So if you want to check it out, if you want to support me, definitely subscribe and hit the notification bell so you see the stuff that I post that I'm super so excited about. And if you like it, you know, tell me that you like it. Tell me that you enjoy it or tell me that you don't. Tell me what to fix. Either way, let me know. Information is key. Knowledge is power. Tell me. But, <laughs> 
make sure you do all that normal YouTube stuff like, like, and subscribe, just like I just said. And until next time, my name is DJ Moore. This is the Modern Ninja. This is my umbrella, and I'm out.